10, a shaky mystery rattling Canton. Tremors are tormenting people in the city and no one knows what's causing it. We are talking about shaking glass and clanging dishes. And people live, who live near Fellows Creek Golf Course have been dealing with this for months now. 7 Action News reporter Brian Abel is live to explain this baffling situation tonight. Brian. Yeah, everybody is baffled because they've checked their homes, they checked their basements thinking that this was an isolated issue, but then after last night, they realized that others are experiencing it too. Listen to this. It's been going on for a while now. It's been months, three weeks ago, two weeks ago. It went three days straight. It's just like this weird shaking in her house, and at first, it sounds like somebody's drilling up right against your wall. People in Canton, the area of South Watts and Palmer, describing the mysterious phenomenon. When it starts, the actual the water actually shakes in the bottle. The pictures on the walls, you can hear them slap up against the walls. You'll get a kind of a high a pitched sound that puts pressure in your ears, kind of like when you're on an airplane, almost like a helicopter going over. 18 yeah, years oh yeah, here, kind of but thing. six, eight months that the vibration's been going on. Monday night, the most intense it's been. I heard a really bad shaking, and then I heard something fall, and I t went to my fiance, and I was like, uh, did somebody just break in or what? Because it was so loud and so forceful. I went to our spare bedroom, and there were some boxes that were completely knocked over, and they were like 25 pound boxes. Any clue what it could be? No. Bigfoot. <laughs> so far, no answers. We Motor thought it was the pipes. We thought it was a furnace. We <laughs> thought it was, you know, so many it, things. It, you know, makes your animals irritated. You'll even irritate, irritate a reptile. A Canton mystery. <laughs> That's it. It's a Canton mystery. And we did just talk with the township. They are stumped as well, but they have been able to rule a few things out. It's not a landfill. It's not any gas lines. They actually checked with the U.S. Geological Survey, who verifies that there's no seismic activity in the area as well. So if anybody does continue to experience this, the village asks you to call public safety. Reporting live again, Brian Abel, 7 Action News. All right, thank you so much, Brian.